Okay, so Orangeburg came up on your radar, but you don't know anything about it. Don't worry, I got you covered. My name is Will Mine. I'm a local realtor here in Orangeburg, South Carolina, and I'm going to give you five things that you need to know about Orangeburg. Let's go. Okay, guys, we get to talk about Orangeburg, South Carolina. I don't know if you can tell, I'm excited. I'm really excited about this. Why? Because this is where I live. This is where I was born and raised. Um, I, I have my family here. We, I'm raising my kids here. They go to school here. The whole nine. So I'm fully invested here in Orangeburg, South Carolina. And I'm going to give you an honest opinion and also let you know some great things about Orangeburg, South Carolina. So... First things first, number one, Orangeburg is growing. Guys, I'm, I've been here all my life, right? And this is the most I have seen Orangeburg taking that step into providing more things in the community for the people. And I'm super excited. And some of the things that I'm seeing here in Orangeburg is um, a lot of new construction. And that's, I'm talking about not just houses, I'm talking about businesses, guys, restaurants. Um, different uh, new jobs are being created because of the new businesses that are coming to Orangeburg. And I'm really excited about that because that just, you know, um, Yale's growth right there. A lot of new construction, single family housing is going up. Um, Orangeburg is one of those areas where you can possibly get a little bit more land um, around your house, okay? So we'll say also, don't let me forget, uh, Orangeburg, has built some things for the community. Uh, one of the things I'm gonna highlight is so many things is the recreational sports complex that they just recently built. Multi-million dollar uh, 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 facility that they built, man, I'm, I'm talking about, it is nice. Um, recently went there, um, maybe a couple weeks ago to watch a baseball game with my daughters, okay? And also they got like walking and running trails. You can go out there and exercise. And me and one of my buddies, we go out there and run sometimes. So it's it's enjoyable. I mean, it's a lot of scenery out there as well, ponds and places you can have picnics, guys. So just a nice family-oriented place um, that you can go and and just feel like you know enjoy a good afternoon or a good day. Uh, and and just something for the community that I'm really proud of that they did something like that in Orangeburg. Right in front of that facility, just to give you some more, is a, a new VA clinic that was just put here. Um, I think that's needed for our veterans. And um, a lot of people that I know that are veterans can come right there and get taken care of right here in Orangeburg. Another multi-million dollar um, investment that was put right here in Orangeburg. Number two, Orangeburg has two universities and, co and one college. A lot of people don't, didn't know that. Um, these are two amazing HBCUs. Uh, one is South Carolina State University, go Bulldogs. Um, also, um, number two, uh, the second university is Claflin University. Oh, an amazing um, university that was ranked like top 10 in HBCUs in the nation. And I'm just super proud of them and all of they're doing and development that I'm seeing over there. I think they're building like a new student center uh, from my understanding that's going up over there right now. It's massive. So um, I'm super excited for them. And then also we have Orangeburg Technical College that has a great dynamic uh, nursing program over there that's going on right now. So um, if if you are interested in like higher education or if you want to be closer to your university or college, consider Orangeburg, man. I mean, they have two universities and one college here. So, I mean, tons of education right here in the big city of Orangeburg. All right. Number three, Orangeburg has some great communities and neighborhoods. A lot of people don't know about that. OK, um, I, ha I had uh, I remember when I first bought my home um, and my friends came over for the open house. They were out of Columbia and they came down. And I was like, man, um, I didn't know Orangeburg had it like this. I said, yeah, man, um, a lot of people sleep on Orangeburg. So 
Orangeburg has some great communities. I'm gonna name a few. Ramsgate community, um, subdivision. Edistow Plantation. Um, Laurel Hill, Oakfield. These are some great neighborhoods that Orangeburg has that you can pick from. Um, some of them have new construction homes. Some of them have, you know, a lot of resale homes um, that you can um, purchase or, or invest in, okay? Um, one of the, the cool things I like about uh, one, one community in particular is Ramsgate. Ramsgate average lot size is like acre and a half, two acres, okay? So you get a, a ton of land with your house. Now they are at a higher price point and that price point, you know, typically ranges in between, you know, that 400 to, you know, $500,000 of a house now, but you get some, get a lot of bang for your buck out there. Um, but if, you know, you're looking for something um, on a lower, lower price range, we have a ton of communities that are great family oriented. I mean, just great places to live right here in Orangeburg, South Carolina. Number three, Orangeburg is in a great location. The city itself is in a great location. And what I mean by that, so Orangeburg is centrally located between the capital, which is Columbia, and Charleston, South Carolina, which is on the coast. So depending on what you want to do that weekend, and let's just say you want to go to the beach. Man, you shoot right to Charleston, it's about an hour and a half drive, and you can go right there to the beach. You're right there on, on the coast, okay? Or you can shoot to Columbia, and let's just say, you know, you want to catch a college um, football. I mean, well, I say that, Orangeburg has college football right here in Orangeburg, but let's say you want to see the Gamecocks, USC play. You can go right there to Columbia and, you know, enjoy that there. Nice college town um, in Columbia and also shopping in both lo locations as well. So, you know, your outlet shopping down there in Charleston, just, just centrally located right in between the two, Charleston and Columbia, which is a great place to be just in case you want to go east or west okay so that's why i put location as number four things you need to know about orangeburg now number five orangeburg has one of the best and i'm going to say it again the best one of the best golf courses in south carolina now if you don't play golf i totally understand but the cool thing about this place is that it has like if you were part of the club you get to go to it they got swimming pools they got a recreational area for kids and stuff like that so it's really like a really nice club to be a part of if if you play golf or if you just like um the rec recreational things to do so the reason i like this golf course so much guys and I'm, let me just tell you every time i play there i mean like it is it is kept up so well immaculate i mean i can't find a pine cone out of place out there that's how cool that place is so just to let you know like i i google like rankings and stuff like that so on golf pass if you go on golf pass that golf course is rated 4.9 out of five stars okay i'm gonna say it again 4.9 out of five stars so definitely consider you know orangeburg uh, because like it just has so many great things that I enjoy here and more to come. So Orangeburg is steadily growing. Like I said, number one, um, number two has two great um, universities and one college. Also number three, amazing communities. I mean, nice communities that you can you know grow your family and be safe and feel secure. Okay, and number four. It's in a great location in between Columbia and Charleston um, and, and centrally located right there in between the two. And, num and, and number five is one of the best golf courses in the state, okay? So I hope by me doing this video kind of gave you some understanding about Orangeburg, okay? Because I think sometimes people try to Google and they don't really know Orangeburg unless you speak with someone that's from there, okay? I'm your point of contact, Will My Berry, and um, like I said, this is, um, I'm an Orangeburg native. I will be more than happy to serve you if you have any questions or real estate needs in the area. If you enjoyed this video, hit that subscribe button, hit the thumbs up button, or even share it to someone that you think that might value the content that I provided. If you need anything, please let me know. Will my head with the Bear Group broker by EXP Realty. Let's go.